and let's get started. To start this hairstyle, I'm going to part my hair in a deep side part on the left side. Then I'm going to continue the part line down towards the nape of my neck and clip away the hair on the right side. Now I'm going to divide this left section into two halves, a top and a bottom, and clip away the bottom hair. Then I'm going to pick up a section near the hairline and divide it into three smaller pieces for the braid. I'm going to start by crossing the right strand over the middle and then cross the left strand over the middle. Now I'm going to cross the right strand over the middle, pick up a new section of hair, and cross it over and into the middle strand. Then I'm going to drop down the left strand, pick up a new section of hair, and cross it over the middle strand in place of the dropped piece. Then I'm going to cross the right strand over the middle, pick up a new section of hair, and cross it over and into the middle strand. Then I'm going to drop down the left strand, pick up a new section of hair, and cross it over the middle strand in place of the dropped piece. And I'm just going to repeat those steps, continuing the waterfall braid until it reaches the back of my head. Now I'm just going to braid the rest of the section a little further down and then slide a bobby pin over the bottom. Now I'm going to let down the bottom section of hair and clip the braid out of the way. I'm going to pick up a new section of hair near the hairline and divide it into three smaller pieces for the second braid. And I'm creating a Dutch braid so I'm going to cross the right strand under the middle and then cross the left strand under the middle. Now I'm going to cross the right strand under the middle, pick up the first waterfall piece and cross it under and into the middle strand. Then I'm going to cross the left strand under the middle, pick up a new section of hair and cross it under and into the middle strand as well. And I'm just going to repeat those steps, continuing the Dutch braid, bringing in the waterfall pieces on the right side of the braid while adding in new sections on the left side of the braid until I've brought in all of the waterfall sections and I'm going to add the braid from the first section as the last piece brought into the braid and then I'm just going to braid the rest of the section a little further down and then tie off the bottom with a clear elastic band. Then I'm just going to unclip the rest of the hair, backcomb a few sections near the part line to add a little bit of volume to finish the style. 